Hi guys. It's Tuesday and I'm back. It's been a really long time. It hasn't been that long, but I feel like it's been a while. Actually, I think it was June when I last uploaded and now we're in the ends of March. I don't think it was June, maybe July. It was early July. But currently driving. Well, I'm not driving yet, but I will be in a moment. Um, I'm gonna go to school. That always sounds weird. So Mondays are usually spent with, um, I took some clips, so I'm just gonna show you guys. My Mondays are usually spent at home doing distance learning and yesterday zoom was down so I was kind of worried that I wasn't gonna be able to um, you know do anything because you never know with these technological advances you never know if it's gonna work or if it's not gonna work out it really just depends on the day so thankfully I got onto Zoom. We did some hair styling, like some updos. I did a French twist and stuff. You know how that goes. But anyway, today is Tuesday. We have on campus, um, on campus learning today. It's uh, really just been fun. We are on clinic floor, which means that we're taking clients and Whoa. Yeah, so that was safe. Anyway, so we're taking clients and it's been interesting. I haven't had a client yet. So hang on, we're making a turn. Sharp turns, sharp turns. I need a better system here. Anyway, so we're on clinic floor. I'm supposed to be taking clients. Haven't had my first client yet. Um, that goes or maybe you don't but, but that's what's been happening um yet last week I worked dispense this week I'm blocked for training and I'm not sure what that means I don't know if that means that I have a client today but I'm assuming that it would say that I have like a woman's cut or a men's cut or a color or something but the camera's not even facing me that's not the case it just says training um, so I'm driving to school. I left a little bit early so that I had enough time to get some coffee and stuff. Also, pumpkin spice is back. Yes, but that is, uh, you know, the extent of my morning. I have like, I was trying to get my banana it broke in half, so I have two half bananas. So I need to eat those sooner rather than later before they get all gross. Um, but that is pretty much, you know, what's been happening. Uh, it's been a weird couple of weeks. I've been feeling very, I just don't like myself recently. I think I'm going to listen to my podcast, uh, there's a new cult leader episode, so I'm going to listen to that, and then I'll catch up with you once I get to Starbucks, because your girl needs some coffee, so I'm going to continue driving, and I'm going to listen to my podcast. Hey. Okay. I don't mind masks. Do you guys mind masks? Let me know in the comments. I enjoy masks. It's fucking weird. Um, but that smells like pumpkin spice. Oh my God, it's like liquid fall in a cup. I'm basic. Whatever. 
Anyway, I have a while until school. So, I mean, oh, I'm gonna lock my doors because I'm paranoid. This is a horrible angle. So I'm gonna try to take you along with me today. I don't know how much I can film um, just because I'm awkward and I don't, I don't know, I don't wanna make anyone uncomfortable by walking in with like this giant TSLR. But what I can do, I will try. And if I can't get anything, I'm sorry. Um, yeah. So, that's what I'm gonna be doing. Um, that's, that's the end of it. So I'm gonna drive to school. I might get some gas. Matt said not to worry about gas, but like your girl's gonna worry about gas. It's clearly another day. I had my first client on clinic floor yesterday. It was a haircut. Um, it went well. I was super nervous and she just really wanted to go super short. And my instructor said, just don't go too short the first time, go short the last time. And so it took a while because I was trying to, you know, not go too short the first time. But anyway, she got like a angled, well, it's a triangular bob where it's longer in the front, shorter in the back, but it's all just one length. Um, and, you know, that's what was happening. Um, but I did it, it went well. Um, yeah. yeah, it's been a really weird couple days mentally. So that's what's been going on. Um, I think I need to just dabble in a little bit more self-care. Um, yeah. And then I think I'm gonna stream later on today. Right now I'm in doing school, so there's that. And I think we're gonna go get some pumpkin spice because that's just who we are. So that's what's been going on. I'm gonna go ahead and just go see if she's actually paying attention and stuff. All right, so we went to Starbucks. We got our pumpkin spice, our liquid fall, and um, now I'm setting up my stream. I'm gonna stream for a couple of hours. Amberlynn got her work done and she has two of each. Um, like two papers of each and she had her last Zoom call so she's done two of each. But I'm gonna have her save one, one sheet of the math and one sheet of the science for afternoon like as homework just so you know, just like it would be at a regular school. Um, but yeah, so she finished her Zoom classes and now I just kind of gave her a little bit of a break. It's one o'clock right now, so I'm gonna stream for maybe like an hour, maybe 30 minutes at most. It really just depends. And then I'm gonna actually head out to Target. One, because I've been seeing people post about Halloween decor in the dollar spot. Um, too because um, I find Target is just easier to maneuver when it's me and just the girls. There just seems to be like less people and it's not as busy. Granted this weekend it was busy because I think everyone was moving into the dorms. I live in a university town for the most part and so yeah that gets pretty busy. I'm hoping that's gonna help me out at school as well because I know like college students some of them, you know, go to beauty schools to get their hair done, so we'll see. Because school is starting, even if it's like, they're at least in my town, they're doing half online, half in person. I don't know. People are living at the dorms. Anyway, I'm going to start my stream.
Target. So I'll show you guys what we got. It's nothing exciting except for two things. I got some of this bread for avocado toast. Because I've been craving avocado toast. And then I got these two avocados. I got these tomatoes. Just with, like the different kinds. And then for dinner, the girls wanted broccoli and beef or beef and broccoli. And then I got my my boring lazy meal, um, my chicken fried rice. And then like I said, last time Matt went to Target, he picked up some spring rolls. I don't know if you can tell what they are, but there's that. Now on to the fun things. So, I've been seeing this witch all over Instagram. And I know it's a candy dish, but I think this makes like the kitchen a little bit more festive, just a little bit nicer. So, she's their dollars at the dollar spot. I'm so excited. But... Okay, hang on. Go. Yes, just wait. So I found yes, go yes. So I found the witch that I've been seeing all over Instagram and stuff at the dollar spot today, and it was so exciting. She's three dollars, and I know she's a candy dish, but I thought she'd make like a cute sponge holder and just to bring a little festivity. I found this sign. says welcome to our dead and breakfast. I thought it would be perfect for our dining area. And that's just pretty much how it looks. As you can see, we haven't really put that much on the walls since we moved in. Like there's some stuff down the hallway, but otherwise it's all just very bland. But all right, so I'm gonna make some spooky <laughs> um, brownies, Matt got these Ghirardelli brownies when he went to um, Costco last, so I'm gonna make some, and yeah, that's what we're doing. So, hi, welcome to Thursday. I haven't vlogged at all today, but I mean, were we expecting anything less from me? Anyway, um, I was gonna stream, but then I got into looking for some old Halloween decor, and um, I ended up getting lost in that. So I don't know where all our Halloween decor went from last year. Like I have some things that I left out all year, obviously, but I just can't, can't find the rest. But I will show you what I found. So over there was my little skeleton man. And then what I want to do is get like a sign that says, powder room or spooky bathroom something along those lines over there that way that it's like pointing that way and then I found some of my spider web it's not the best spider web I think I got it at Goodwill it wasn't used it was like in their new section but last year and it's just not very good so that's what we have going on I think I'm gonna buy more definitely soon I want to hit up the dollar store this weekend but that's for another situation. Yeah, I mean, I found our outdoor ghosts that I put out in front of the door and I hung up on our patio last year. So, there's that. I found those things that, you know, I didn't find anything else, which sucks. But we're gonna move on. I'm just gonna get through it. I mean, it's not like I'm super sad about the fact that I have to 
buy all new Halloween decor. But I did want to show you guys that I went to Walmart for dinner stuff and groceries. But they didn't have a lot of Halloween things. They had like pajamas and cards and stuff. But they definitely didn't have their decor out. So, kind of mad about that. But I did find some candles. I love candles. Candles are the best things in the world. But anyway, I got these for 97 cents. So I got three like mini candles, but what can you do? So I got warm fall leaves. I didn't smell them, obviously, because I was wearing a mask and I wasn't going to take it off or like try to smell it through the mask. But I also got cozy gathering and then I got pumpkin spice. So I figured I would smell them for you right now. So <laughs> let's just prop you guys up. So it's August 27th. And if you're on TikTok, you know. And if you don't, then you're welcome. So I have a lot of anxiety right now. So I'm trying to distract myself. But anyway, we're just gonna move on. The lighting in my kitchen is horrible, so. Anyway, let's smell warm fall leaves. It just kind of smells, I'm going to sound stupid, but it smells warm. It smells like Kirkland's. So you know what I mean when you walk into Kirkland's and you get that smell of like all the candles and all the scents kind of mixing together, but it's like fall and it's cozy. That's what this smells like. It smells like Kirkland's. That's, that's what it is big fan because I used to love going into Kirkland's. There's no Kirkland's in my city anymore so that sucks because I had some really cute Halloween decor. Anyway, we're gonna give Cozy Gathering a, a, a sniff. Um, I'm pretty sure it's gonna smell a lot like Kirkland's or it's gonna smell a lot like this one as well but we'll see. I don't know what that smells like. It's like a very faint, cinnamony, but clean smell, if that makes sense. Like, it's not, it's not as strong. I don't know if I'm gonna like this one, but it's 97 cents, so we can't be choosy. Or, yeah, we can't be choosy. Anyway, on to the one that I know I'm gonna love, or at least I hope so. I'm gonna go with pumpkin spice. Oh, this smells like a pumpkin pie. Oh, I think I got one that was kind of messed up. Or it was a little too hot in my cart. I'm not sure. But nonetheless, it's, it's a really nice smell. It smells like the Bath and Body Works pumpkin spice. And for 98 cents, as opposed to $24, even though this is a mini, or even like the one wick candles at Bath and Body Works, they're like 16 bucks. This is a definite dupe, so. You know, but these two are my favorites. Cozy Worm Gathering, if you want to get it. I, like, I don't know if it smells different when you burn it. I just, I can't figure out what it's supposed to be. It's very mild. But anyway, I think I'm going to end this weekly vlog here. I'm going to make some dinner, and I might film that. I'm going to make spooky mini pizzas, maybe. I don't know. We'll see how that goes. But that's what we're doing. And yeah. So I'm going to get started on that. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Which I'm hoping is going to be a Halloween video. Maybe. We'll see. So. Bye. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.